calls are growing louder tonight for a Niagara Falls-based theme park to get out of the animal business. Critics want marine land to be repurposed after learning more than a dozen whales and a dolphin have died at the tourist attraction in the past four years. Heather right now on the marine mammals and an alarming mortality rate. There's a place I know in Ontario. Once famous for its catchy jingle and killer whales, for years now, marine land has been under scrutiny over allegations it is mistreating its animals. And now the Ontario government confirms 14 whales and one dolphin have died at the Niagara Falls Amusement Park in the last four years. We've known for years that animals have dropped like flies at marine land and there have been concerns raised about conditions for decades at that aquarium. The new details were released as part of a Freedom of Information request made by the Canadian press, which included the number of animals that have died but did not include any causes of death. Ontario's Solicitor General oversees the Animal Welfare Service and says in a statement, Questions regarding the cause of death of the marine mammals at Marineland should be directed to Marineland. AWS continues to conduct compliance investigations at Marineland to determine if the standards of care are being met. I'm furious. This is the fact that this has been going on while the facility has been under investigation by the Provincial Animal Welfare Services. Provincial authorities have raised concerns about the park's water quality in the past and said the marine mammals were under distress. Marineland has denied any link between the deaths and the condition of the water, stating on its website that it has a strong record of caring for its animals and will continue to prioritize their health and well-being. In 2019, Canada passed a law banning the captivity of whales, dolphins and porpoises. Animals already living at places like Marineland were exempt, as there is currently no alternative place for them to go. A whale sanctuary is in the works off the coast of Nova Scotia. In the meantime, the Ontario government says it will continue to monitor Marineland, who did not respond to our request to comment on this story. Heather Wright, CTV News, Toronto.